بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الصلاة والسلام على رسول الله أجمعين صلى الله على سيدنا محمد Excellency, Excellency Comrade Dr. Abi Ahmed Ali President of uh, Prosperity Party and Prime Minister of uh, Repub Federal Democratic Republic of Ethiopia Excellency Deputy Prime Minister Vice President of PP Party, Brother Damak Emokanen, dear Executive Committee members of the Prosperity Party, dear Congressist, all protocol observed. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. <laughs> Dear Dawa, it will the religion so on. Gen Amarium Atamarum Zarim and the Amarium Negral. Excellency, allow me to extend a congratulatory. Congratulatory, sorry, message from uh, His Excellency, President of RPP, President of the Republic of Djibouti, and your friend and brother, Ismail Omar Geli. I would also like to convey my gratitude and special thanks to the government and people of Ethiopia as well as Prosperity Party for the warm welcome extend to the delegation of RPP since our arrival. <laughs> I'm much honored today speaking in the opening ceremony on the first Congress, historical Congress of Prosperity Party and reaffirm the strong bonds that exist between our two sisterly countries with, by strengthening from days after days the party-to-party -party relations. Excellencies, comrades, since its inception, Prosperity Party has made a significant stride in responding to the demand of the people of Ethiopia Prosperity is indeed a party that has brought peace, stability, political reform in Ethiopia and has been able to set the support and legitimize the credibility of the people of Ethiopia by holding the first democratic election and by winning the heart of the people in this country. <laughs> Prosperity Party with a vision of building a strong democratic government and an inclusive economic and social development which ensures equal benefit of the people of Ethiopia is tirelessly working to bring prosperity to the country that also benefit in the neighboring countries in the region. People's Rally Party of Djibouti will give a due respect to the commitment of the ruling party and the government of Ethiopia's amnesty for releasing the high-profile political prisoner and an effort to facilitate national reconciliation. We believe the national dialogue will bring a lasting solution to the overall problem the country has encountered for the last few years. The National Dialogue Commission is expected to pave the way for national consensus so that the country enjoys peace, development, and prosperity. We also appreciate the effort committed by the ruling Prosperity Party, the government, as well as people of Ethiopia in maintaining the unity 
territorial integrity and sovereignty of the country. During the last four years, the ruling party and the government of Ethiopia worked hard to bring regional integration and cooperation with your neighboring countries, implementing the new concept brought by a great leader, Dr. Abiy Ahmed, which is called Madamar. In this regard, RPP, who is going to celebrate its 43 years in few day, in few weeks, shares common value with Prosperity Party in that both parties are working for the betterment of the people as well as for the prosperity of the country and the region as a whole. Comrades, Excellencies, as we all well aware, Djibouti and Ethiopia are integrating their economies and working hard to further strengthen their collaboration with a view of building a better future for the peoples. Our relationship is broader, deeper, wider than just an economic relationship. It's characterized by strong people-to-people -people relations that exist since centuries. Our relationship are natural, natural. Our link is emotional, and our future is common destiny. The people of both sides are the borders. The people on the both sides of the borders are linked by blood. They are the same people whose fates are inextricably intertwined. In this regard, people rally for progress, attribute particular importance for the long standing ties between the two countries and is keen to further enhance, strengthen, and promote our party-to-party -party relation. Excellencies, Excellency Dr. Abiy Ahmed, Excellencies, dear Congresses and friends, Republic of Djibouti, government and leader, President Ismail Omar Ghali, remain committed to work hand in hand and for the best of our common destiny. <laughs> Strong, united, peaceful, and prosperous Ethiopia is very important and to the paramount, not only for Ethiopia, but also for Djibouti and for the whole region and the continent. <laughs> Ethiopia will and must prevail Ethiopians will and must remain united and solve their differences by their own, not be influenced from abroad. <laughs> it's very important that we Djiboutianize or Ethiopianize or Africanize democracy, not an export. <laughs> And the Maria proverb and Madam Excellency, Dr. Ahmed, Abiy Ahmed. Madam Mar, Magana. Mangarachin, will seek in that Madarashachin. Long life, long life RPP PP relationship, long life ETO Djibouti relationship, long life to the leader, Dr. Ahmed, the Abiyah Ahmed. I thank you very much. Thank you so much, Your Excellency, Mr. Elias Mosa, for very inspi inspirational messages. 
and best wishes about their home country, second home.